Hey guys, since the Dan here, I just thought I'd uh, give you a little update. I have ordered a green screen and it has arrived today. And I just thought I'd do a little video, you know, about it, just showing you it, showing it to you basically. So let's have a look at it. But here's the main article itself, and it is a very nice colour of green. Yeah, green is my favourite colour, and this is the kind of green I like. <laughs> It's um, uh, a 2 meters by 3 meters uh, muslin uh, cloth, basically. Green, obviously. And um, yeah, it, came, it comes with a, a little carrier case, a carrying case for it, which is handy. Always is. And yeah, basically, this is going to be my replacement for this, which was my blue screen, which is basically my bed sheet. Yeah, I got. I basically hung it using the the hooks. The hook that holds. Let me try and get it right. The hook that holds this uh, calendar up. The hook that holds this picture up, and I got a hook behind here. I don't know if you can see it or not. Um, I'm trying to see on the camera. Nope, hang on. It's about there, yeah, if I zoom in, you might be able to see it better. Wrong way. And up. There, yeah, see so I got a hook for there as well. Yeah, so, let me zoom out again. I forgot to zoom out. Yeah, so basically, yeah, so this green screen is going to replace the blue screen. Because, uh, well, the entire room is blue, and the fact that I'd have a blue screen and a fluorescent light below there, uh, basically it makes me look blue. So I thought, if I have a green screen, I might cancel that out a bit, I don't know. We'll see. But anyway, I also wanted this, because it's bigger, and also I plan on doing videos outside this room as well. I have got a stand set coming for it as well, which, uh, and again, is a budget thing. This was only £24 off Amazon. Uh, the stands I've ordered are uh, softbox uh, stands. Uh, those were £19 as a pair, which and I bought those. They ca they don't come with a cross mount to hold this up, so I have to make that myself. But um, the reason I didn't order proper stands for this is because on Amazon and eBay and stuff like that, they were £50 plus, and I don't have that kind of money to throw throw around. So. I thought I'd just get the stands, make my own. Simple. So this is the thing I'll be using for the foreseeable future. Hopefully I can get better chroma key off it. I Now that I got this, I'm probably going to look into getting better lighting now. I can't really see how much lighting I can get into here. If anyone knows where I can find miniature softboxes, because the lighting of the screen is my main issue, uh, I'm trying to find, because I've seen Spoonie's video, and he, I've seen he uses softboxes to light his green screen. I can't fit things that big in this room, because I've measured this room, and it is, no joke, it is 8.5 foot by 7.5 foot, which is crap. So I'm looking for miniature lighting now. So I, if anyone knows where I can find small, almost desk lamp size softboxes, you know, with the the shade and whatnot and the diffuser. Anyone, if anyone knows where I can find something like that, that I could just put one on the windowsill and one on my little uh, pile of crap there, you know, that would be a big help because that's my main issue now with green screening is uh, the lighting. But that's all I'm looking for is two miniature soft boxes, desk lamp size preferably, but no bigger, you know. Maybe smaller, I'll have a look, see if they're good enough. And I'm looking for some that are fluorescent lights, and preferably that don't get too hot. So, um, well, that's my video on my green screen. Um, we'll see what uh, what chroma key magic I can work with this in the future. See ya.